Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you have customized a presentation by adding the slide masters and slide layouts you want, you can save it as a template you can use to create new presentations in the future. In PowerPoint 2013 and 2010, you can save a presentation as a custom template by clicking the File tab in the ribbon and then clicking the Save As command in the Command panel in the Backstage view. If using PowerPoint 2013, select to save the file to your computer and then click the Browse button to the right. In both versions of PowerPoint, you will then see the Save As dialog box appear. If using PowerPoint 2007, you can save your custom template by clicking the Microsoft Office button and then clicking the Save As command in the Command panel to open this Save As dialog box. In the Save As dialog box, you can type a name for your new template into the File Name text box. Then select PowerPoint Template or PowerPoint Macro Enable Template from the Save As Type drop-down. You should save it to the default folder that PowerPoint then selects for you so that you may able to easily use it later. This folder that PowerPoint selects is where PowerPoint stores its default templates. That way, in the future, you can easily select the template to use as a basis for new presentations by simply choosing it from the listing of available templates that is shown when you create a new presentation. When you are ready, click the Save button to save the template. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.